Yahusha, Joshua 19. And the second lot came forth to Shimon, even for the tribe of the children of Shimon, according to their families. And their inheritance was within the inheritance of the children of Yahuda. And they had in their inheritance Be'er, Shiva, or Shiva, and Molada, and Chatzar, Shu'al, and Bala, and Etzem, and El Talad, and Bethuel, and Choma, and Siklak, and Beit Ham Makarvath, and Chatzar Kukath, rather Kuka, and Beit Lavaoth, and Sharachan, thirteen cities and their villages, Ain, Ramon, and Ether, and Dashan, four cities and their villages, and all the villages that were round about these cities to Balaath, Be'er, Ramath of the Negev. This is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Shimon, according to their families. Out of the portion of the children of Yahuda was the inheritance of the children of Shimon. For the part of the children of Yahuda was too much for them. Therefore, the children of Shimon had their inheritance within the inheritance of them. And the third lot came up for the children of Zevalin, according to their families, and the border of their inheritance was unto Sarid, and their border went up toward the sea, and Mar Allah, and reached to Dabashet, and reached to the river that is before Yochanam, and turned from Sarid eastward toward the sun rising, unto the border of Kikloth Tavor and then goes out to Davarath, and goes up to Yafia, and from thence passes on, along on the east to Gita Sefer, to Ita Katsin, and goes out to Rimon Ham Mator, to Nia. And the border compasses it on the north side to Chana Othon, and the outgoings thereof are in the valley of Yifta Ch'el, and Kotath, and Nahala, and Shimron, and Yidala, and Beit Lechem, twelve cities with their villages. This is the inheritance of the children of Zevalin, according to their families, these cities with their villages. And the fourth lot came out to Yishakar, for the children of Yishakar, according to their families. And their border was toward Yizri El, and Kesiloth, and Shonem, and Chafraim, and Shion, and Anakarath, and Yabith, and Kioshon, and Ivetz, and Remeth, and Ein Ganim, and Ein Chada, and Beit Patsasets, and the coasts, rather coast, reaches to Tevor, and Shachtemashama, and Beit Shemesh, and the outgoings of their border were at the Ardan, sixteen cities with their villages. This is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Yishakar, according to their families, the cities and their villages. And the fifth lot came out for the tribe of the children of Asher, according to their families. And their border was Che, El Kat, and Kali, and Beten, and Achsfa, rather Achsaf, and Alamelech, and Amad, and Mishal, and reaches to Carmel westward, and to Shichor, Livnath, and turns toward the sun rising to Beit Degan, and reaches to Zevalin, and to the valley of Liftach El, toward the north side of Beit Ha'emech, and Ni'ai El, 
and goes out to Kabul on the left hand. And Hebron and Rechov and Haman and Chana, even unto great Sidon. And then the coast turns to Ramah and to the strong city Sor. And the coast turns to Chohach. And the outgoings thereof are at the sea from the coast to Agziv. Uma also and Afech and Rechov, 20 and two cities with their villages. This is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Asher, according to their families, these cities with their villages. The sixth lot came out to the children of Naphtali, even for the children of Naphtali, according to their families. And their coast was from Chelef, from Alan to Sa'anaim, and Admi, Nechev, and Yavna'el, unto Lachum, and the outgoings thereof were at the Yardan. And then the coast turns westward to Asnoth Tevor, and goes out from thence to Chukok, and reaches to Zevalon on the south side, and reaches to Asher on the west side, and to Yahuda upon the Yardan toward the sun rising. And the fenced cities are Sedim, Ser, and Chemath, Rachath, and Kinneroth, and Adama, and Rama, and Chatzor, and Kedesh, and Edri'i, and Ain Chatzor. And Yeron and Migdael, Cherem, and Beit Anath, and Beit Shemesh, nineteen cities with their villages. This is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Naphtali, according to their families, the cities and their villages. And the seventh lot came out for the tribe of the children of Dan, according to their families. And the coast of their inheritance was Sor Ah and Ashtaol and Ir Shemesh and Sha'al Abin and Ela'an and Yithla and Ilan and Timnatha and Ikran and Eltika and Gibbethon and Baalath and Yahud and Beni Barach and Gath Remon and Mehai Yarkon, and Rachon, with the border, before Yafo. And the coast of the children of Dan went out too little for them. Therefore the children of Dan went up to fight against Leshem, and took it, and smote it with the edge of the sword, and possessed it, and dwelt therein, and called Leshem, Dan, after the name of Dan, their father. This is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Dan, according to their families, these cities with their villages. When they had made an end of dividing Eth the land for inheritance by their coasts, the children of Yashar'el gave an inheritance to Yahusha, the son of Nun, among them. According to the word of Yahuwah, they gave him Eth the city, which he asked, even Eth Timnath, Sarach, in Mount Ephraim. And he built Eth the city, and dwelt therein. These are the inheritances which Eleazar the priest, and Yahusha the son of Nun, and the heads of the fathers of the tribes of the children of Yashar'el, divided for an inheritance by lot in Shiloh, before Yahuwah, at the door of the tabernacle of the assembly. So they made an end of dividing Eth the country.